Hey guys. Well, this is a very odd video. It's like three in the morning. I sure never be awake. Um, I went to sleep like really early, like really early, like yesterday. Um, I woke up about three. I'd say actually I saw a shadow on the ceiling and I thought, please tell me not. And it was just a spider and I watched this is my habit when I'm like afraid of something. Obviously I'm tall but I'm not that tall that I can get something to catch it from the ceiling. So anyway, um, I was watching it go on to my curtains and by the way, sorry about the mess. And it's, I've tried everything, it's behind, you know the dark part of the curtains it's like quite a big spider as well it's behind there and i've tried everything i've tried hitting the curtains i've tried i had to move it there because i don't want anything landing on my bed but yeah like yesterday morning um there was like a group of baby spiders on top there and i had to get some tissue and take them down because I feel like there's like a nest maybe growing in my vent which I am pissed about but anyway as I'm trying to get this spider down I have noticed I don't know if you can see that uh, a group of baby spiders over there and some baby spiders over there as well which you can't see but I am literally this is like a disaster movie. I am my room is literally being taken over by my phobia, and you know, if hexes, if hexes aren't, if someone says hexes aren't real or curses aren't real, I think I think this is proof that they are. Because why, of all places, would a group of spiders be deciding to just take refuge? in my room with all bedrooms by the way and yeah they're only tiny spiders but they're gonna grow and one day be the size of this spider which i am still trying to get down it's one is like ridiculous o'clock in the morning no i haven't brushed my teeth because i'm not supposed to be awake and i've been trying to fight a spider since my eyes open so yeah that is my life and I've tried everything to sort of try and smack the spider I was hoping it will fall down and then I can quickly catch it with this candle lid but nope no such luck and above all my mum she's not feeling very well like before I had COVID like that's why I was filming on Monday and Tuesday I had COVID and um I was off from work but I'm feeling a lot better now but now my mum doesn't feel well so yeah so anyway um I'm trying to catch this spider and after I'm done catching this big spider I'm going to take care of it I just I feel this so disgusting I feel like I need to just clean my room because this was not there last night I can assure you like it wasn't and I feel like I'm going to go into an overdraft again. Honestly, I live in my overdraft. But I need to go to B&Q to get some spider repellent to spray in there. And I think there might be a nest. Like, there might be a web outside. Like, I did see a few weeks ago a web forming outside, but I just left it. And so having your windows open, not a good idea. I feel itchy, I feel grubby, and I just want to get rid of the spider, rid of these ones, and just get a huge basin of water and just scrub my room. You know, I might actually do a keep clean with me because, yeah, I mean, it's not how, it's not how I am intending on living, so... I just turned you on for company by the way, I mean like, I know it's kind of random, but everyone's asleep, I'm the only one with this huge spider phobia fear, I mean my brother don't really like spiders either, but 
he's just not as scared of them as I am. And yeah, I mean, I just need to get rid of this spider because I am tired. I want to return to bed, but obviously, I need to deal with this spider. So I'm sorry if my lips are dry, my face is dirty. Um, I don't have any good looks on your face. No, it's fine. But I just need to spend the day scrubbing this room and I need to buy some serious spider repellent because those little spiders is going to one day look like that big spider and I am not having an army of giant spiders in my room. No way. No, no, no way. Part of me told me, <laughs> part of me thought, maybe I should just burn my cut. <laughs> I'm joking. I mean, that is like so stupid. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to show you right now, like, how it is not moving. Like, it is, like, not moving. I feel like maybe it's the mummy spider coming to find out what... <laughs> where her baby spiders went. Is that a piece of... I don't know if that's... It's not... The spider, that's... A piece of fluff, I think. Oh wait, that's the spider. Shit. Do you see that, guys? At least I think that's a spider. You see, because this, these curtains, they kind of fray a little. It's hard to tell. Like, yeah, it's hard to tell, honestly. As you can see, I am clearly shaken. I don't like spiders whatsoever. I mean, they're, the, they're devil made, they're ugly, they're horrible. <sighs> I honestly can't tell if that is a spider or if that's... That's just a f the f that means the spider still is up there. I mean, like, if that was the spider, then I could catch it with this but nope it's not the spider is determined to stay there and the thing is if it goes back on the ceiling I don't know how I'm gonna get it I need it to be on the wall like honestly all these these little creepy crawlies they know like they know to stay on the ceiling because they know our stupid humans can't reach them <laughs> but um and as soon as you think, oh great, it's coming on the wall, I can catch it. It goes back up onto the ceiling. Do you ever find that? That's so annoying. Anyway, so I need to find out how I'm going to get rid of this spider. And then I'm going to do a serious clean with me. I still have things that I need to bring to charity. I have so much to do. But this spider is preventing me from sleeping. It was dark, by the way. Well, not dark, but it was like semi-dark when I woke up now look how bright it is and I still have not caught this spider great you know what <clears throat> this is what happens when you have a phobia though I mean like if it was like an ant or if it was something else I could just go up there pull the curtain look but I don't even want to look because I know as soon as I see it I'm gonna go back into my freaked out mode where I'm just gonna be standing here trying to tell myself to get rid of it when my feet won't move. Because that's what happens when it comes to spiders. I just stand there telling myself I need to get rid of it when I know it won't move. Like, <laughs> I know, um, sorry. Like, the thing is, yeah, if it. I feel like. If I had moved the curtain, because I saw it was heading towards the curtain, but I was so frozen, like, something told me it's going to go on the curtain, isn't it? It's going to go on the curtain, but I just could not move to it, because it was crawling around on the ceiling. I didn't want it, you know, when spiders do that thing where they, like, very spontaneously, like, 
start a web and just start luring. So I didn't want it to do that. Um, but I probably would have caught it by now if it wasn't on the curtain. Oh, I feel itchy. Oh my god. Like, I feel really itchy. Like, to think I was actually asleep with a spider across the ceiling. Like, what if it landed on me? What if it knew that I was the person who flushed its baby out the toilet? <laughs> yeah, that's what I did. I got a whole bunch of tissue, swapped it up, threw it in the toilet and flushed it. I'm not horrible, but hey. I have no idea. I'm actually feeling a little frustrated at the moment because I am tired. I did not intend on waking up to a room full of spiders. My room is a mess, yeah, but it's an organised mess. I know where everything is and, you know, like, yeah, a few things need straightening up. But my room is not so messy that a nest of spiders should be in it. Like... <laughs> No, like, my, I don't even have cobwebs in my room. Well, I probably do now because of these little spiders, but I don't even have, like, you know when you go into someone's house and they have, like... See, do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see that? Oh, my God, I need to go. Do you see that, guys? Over here, so you can see when you try get rid of this spider I knew it's still on the back there but I have to get rid of it there's no time to be a pussy right now because at the moment oh, it's in such an awkward place oh my god oh, I'm scared guys I'm literally scared look at it it's so big It's moving, it's moving. No! Okay, <sighs> come now. I should I should have caught it Did you see that spider, guys? See, I thought it was on my curtain. I thought it, and it looks bigger than I remember it being. And now it's gone back up. You see, this is what happens when you're a coward like I am. Because I don't like spiders, I can't stand them. I literally, like... I don't know where it's gone. Great. I have no idea where it went. And if it goes back on the ceiling, I'm screwed. Like, I had an opportunity to catch it, but it was, I was just too scared. Because it is massive. Like, it is a massive spider. Like, I don't like spiders. Like, they are so horrible. Oh my God. And this one moves so quickly as well. It's not even like it was just, I mean, like it was there for a while. I could have caught it, but it just looked so big. And I had to like, I'd have to literally like open the curtain a bit. I can't stand those spiders. I think that is definitely a mummy spider though. I'm not, like no word of a lie. It looks like a mummy spider to me because it's super big and super just like black, like, I don't know if, you know when like spiders are so black, they look bold. You know when like you're on word, I like you put things in bold. That's what they look like. 
Okay, I can't stand spiders, especially when they're jet black like that. Like that. I mean, brown, red, other colours isn't as scary as the giant black spiders because I don't know. I don't know why, but that's the truth and I felt so shaken. But this spider needs to come down because honestly, like, I'm just... Do you see how I dashed you guys down? <laughs> I was hoping that it'll land on, it'll come down and be like on, on the ledge there so that I could quickly grab this pot thing and catch it. I mean like, that's like, that would be like the hardest part, but no. The spider needs to come down. I, I, I could have caught it. Like, you guys saw that, isn't it? I was so good have caught it. But then it started to go back up. I don't even know where it's gone now. Like, I think it's like at the very top. Let's go. Let's go. By the way, yeah, that's me. That's all. No. It's best to use that. What well, should we use? Antibacterial. Well, they're both antibacterial, but you know, I use that one because. freak out when this ugly spider shows its face. Yeah, spiders are so ugly. Like, that's another thing. Like, they're so ugly. Thing. We did it guys, we did it. I didn't even want to throw it out that window. I went into my balcony, I went on to um, in the corridor outside and threw it out of that window because I thought, nope, it is not coming back and it, it fell. And hopefully it fell to its death. It was a big massive spider, heck. <sighs> Boy, that was horrible. How am I going to live alone? That's sort of one question that I ask myself all the time. How am I meant to live alone? Right, now that we've dealt with the big spider, we need to deal with the little ones. So, what I'm going to do is, <clears throat> what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go wash my hands. Wash these because ew. Disgusting. And yeah. Like. <sighs> Just 
the spray tactic was a good one obviously the fumes got to it and it came down and then it got caught which was good <laughs> the end of my um us the end of my usb got trapped as i caught it but I had to, and the spider was like running around in circles, not even, you know when you catch a spider and they're nice and still? No, this spider looked like it was trying to get any kind of escape. And as soon as I opened that door, there was a moth out there. I thought, do not let me drop this spider. Um, I choose a moth over a spider any day. <sighs> that was big. Anyway, um... I'm obviously going to do a clean with me, which I'll probably make that part two of, yeah, there's going to be part one, <laughs> part one and part two, honestly, like, um, yeah, I feel like I just came out of a disaster movie, but I'm still wondering if that was even the biggest spider, because if my room has these little spiders in it. I'm sure there's another spider somewhere. So, some we need to do some cleaning. And fast. Right, so that was part one. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Like, I'm so sorry, I'm such a wuss. Like, I am literally, literally such a wuss. And yeah. I mean, this is, this is, um, this is true though, like, why, my mom used to be like, oh, why don't you ever open my, your windows, and I'd be like, oh, but because of bugs and blah, 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 I open them sometimes, but not all night, left my windows open all night, and look what happens, my room gets taken over by spiders, which I don't know if it's coming from the web outside or the vent because there's a hell of a lot of um, spiders in there, which, well, webs in there, which I'm guessing that's where these lot are from. So yeah, I'm out of breath. And I don't know about you guys, but do you ever feel like, even though you caught the spider, you still feel like, what if it was the twin that you caught? <laughs> uh, anyway, um, I'm sorry, but I'm such a wusk. <laughs> I really am. Like, I'm the biggest wusk ever. It's fallen to its death, hopefully. <laughs> and, yeah. I mean... I know being spiritual, people say, oh, you should be at one with nature and love all nature. But listen, I have hay fever on the oh, look, I love that little bird. Anyway, I have hay fever whenever um, I ever see a tree, my eyes start to play up and all that. And then um, spiders, I don't like. The big horrible bottle top flies, I don't like either. You know, but I'll choose a fly over a spider, obviously. But, um, yeah. I'm glad that I managed to grow a pair and catch it. Because that's sort of a giant spider. <sighs> yeah, so. Now it's time for part two, which part two it's going to be of me doing a deep bedroom clean and a deep clean and um, yeah using buying some spider repellent and getting rid of these also itchy spiders because those little spiders, one day they're going to look like that big spider and I'm not having a room full of those. No way. Like, I'm not Billie Eilish. I don't do spiders. <laughs> anyway, so anyway, like, comment, subscribe, do all the nice things, turn on your notifications and thank you so much for watching. Thanks. Bye.